Okay. We want to simplify this. We want to find, okay, this question has two questions. So given the ratio, right? Well, given the ratio A, B, C, I'm trying to I'm trying to make my pencil work. Okay. Have a divided by three equals b divided by five equals c divided by seven, then equals two thousand twenty-three divided by two thousand twenty-four. This is too big a number to deal with. So because we have this ratio, right? We're looking for a ratio, we're looking for a division of something. So what we can do is we just set this one equal to some variable you can call any variable i like to call it k then i can rewrite a b c so do you see a equals to 3k and b equals to 5k and c equals to 7k right you see that right let's use this one as an example if this equals to k let's move closer you see c k is k over one cross multiply, c times one is c, seven times k, right? Why is that? Think about a half and a three over six. If one person asks you to prove this equation is true, you just do cross multiplication. One times six is six, two times three is six, right? So that's why we can always do cross multiplication. If we have one fraction on the left-hand side, another fraction on the right-hand side. So we'll get those three new relationships. Now we can think A to B to C. So the ratios equals to 3K to 5K to 7K. This little two dots, the colon, means division, right? And uh, we see K, K, K just disappears. So we have three, five, seven, and that's it. Right, so we can ignore because of the ratio problem. We can ignore this two thousand twenty three divided by two thousand twenty four, which is set as a variable, because in the end, because it's ratio, in the end it will cancel out. So let's answer the second one. Second one is not difficult either. Right, we see every one we just change to be k. A equals three k, b equals five k, and c equals seven k, all divided by. 3k plus 5k minus 7k. Well, we see every term has k. We can just ignore k again. So three, the numerator 3 plus 5 plus 7, that's 15. Well, let's write a 15 k. The denominator, I have 3k plus 5k, that's 8k. 8k minus 7k, that's 1k. k over k becomes 1. 15 divided by 1, so it's a 15. All right, I hope this makes sense to you. Come on.